In Madison, city school buses look a little different this year. The goal is to get your attention when they hit the road tomorrow morning. WFF 48's Callie Neese is live at Madison City Schools Transportation Department where she got the down low on safety improvements for the school year. Callie joins us live. Callie, what new technology is on those buses? Madison City Schools says that drivers are not stopping for school buses, but now the district has technology on their side. Reds go out, it's, it's a stop, and it's a stop until the reds come in and, and quit flashing. Seems pretty simple, right? Stop sign goes out, you stop. But Dr. Travis Scrimshire from the Madison City Schools Transportation Department says otherwise. Hundreds. Hundreds? I would say hundreds of times. He tells me that people blow through these flashing red lights all the time. Our hottest areas are on Ma um, Old Madison Pike. That's a huge one uh, because I think I think some people don't understand that that is a that's not a divided highway. It's four lanes, but it's nowhere near. And so but this new technology will help. With our with our new buses that we brought into the fleet over the past couple of years, uh, we have what's known as stop arm technology. And they also added cameras outside of the bus. Someone when someone goes through our reds. Of course, we capture it on on video, and then we have a specific form that the state makes us fill out with all the information. Um, and then locally here, we we can uh, we attach um, still still video frame or live video. If the district will turn evidence over. To to the police who will ticket the driver. Dr. Scrimshire says the goal is to get 7,000 children to school and safely back home. Our district, our parents de de trust and depend on our transportation system and we bus a lot of children uh, to and from school every day and we just have a great time doing it. So looking forward to school starting. Yeah. These buses will slowly be joining the rest of the fleet starting tomorrow for the first day of school. Reporting live in Madison, Kelly Nice 48 News on your side.